Hi everyone, welcome back. Before going into today's video, thanking each one of you for your support, love and care. Our family chat show including my sister-in-law and co-sisters was posted and such an immense support from all of you is what keeps us moving with our work. Thank you so much for being with us as a family. If you haven't watched the show yet on the Jamesh show, the link is given below in my description box again, so do click and watch. Once again, thanking each and every one. Lots of love from all of us. Now back to today's video with a short dinner vlog. Last video I had taken you all for a small shopping with us and in that I had mentioned that I would be posting a recipe with sweet potato. So today is a video for that and it's along with a simple chicken roast. Hope you would like it. Keep watching. That's the box of sweet potato. We normally just boil it and have it as a snack in the evening along with tea. But just trying out something else for dinner. The same we do with tapioca, adding spices and we eat with any non-veg spicy curries or even as such getting that bite from the coconut. Here I am trying the same way with sweet potato. Unlike tapioca, sweet potato gets cooked very fast, so I'm not adding in a pressure cooker. Meanwhile, getting ready for the chicken roast. I'm making the chicken into very small pieces. You can make it into any size, it's up to your preference. Many of you wanted to see how to slice onion in a food processor, quickly showing that. That's a blade used for slicing any vegetables. You can add a whole onion if it's small in size or just cut into half. This is the lid as well as the measuring jar. You need to press it over here and then on the food processor. You get very thin slices. The thickness depends on the quality of the food processor you are using. My mother had a different brand and that wasn't as thin as mine. Now the sweet potatoes are cooked, so draining the water and keeping aside. That's for the chicken roast, 5 to 6 garlic cloves, small piece of ginger, some curry leaves, three to four medium sized tomatoes I 
I'm crushing the ginger and garlic. You can use a blender if you want. Now heat a vessel. Add some coconut oil. When it's heated, adding curry leaves, crushed ginger and garlic. Saute till the raw smell goes. Then add sliced onions. I've used three medium size. Then some salt. Cover and let it get cooked in low flame. That's for the evening tea for me and husband. After the onion has been cooked for few minutes, add the chicken pieces. Mix well and cover for some time. Remove the skin from the sweet potato. In between give a mix to the chicken, then add chopped tomatoes and mix. Cover again and let it get cooked. Once the tomatoes are soft, add 2 tablespoons of red chilli powder, half to 1 teaspoon turmeric powder, 1 to 1 1.5 tablespoon of coriander powder, half teaspoon garam masala, quarter teaspoon fennel seed powder, half teaspoon black pepper powder and mix everything very well. Tea for us and orange for the kids. Now for the sweet potato, take 7 to 8 shallots and green chilies. As per your spiciness, I have taken more as these chilies weren't that spicy. Into a grinder, add 1 cup grated coconut, add shallots and green chilies and grind without adding any water. Lightly mash the sweet potato, not completely, there need to be chunks of it. Into a pot, heat some coconut oil. Then add in mustard seeds, around 1 to 1 and a half teaspoon and splutter it. Then add in curry leaves and 4 to 5 dried red chilies. After a few seconds, add the sweet potato and mix well. Then add the coconut mixture and mix again. Check salt and add if needed. And that's ready. Time for dinner.
men are back after a haircut arman looks very different now We had then gone for shopping at Carrefour you might have seen in my previous video So that's for today's short vlog hope you enjoyed watching it if you haven't subscribed to my channel yet please don't forget to click the subscribe button and press the bell icon for updates See you with another video until then take care bye bye